it's Lily. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. Today, I have a really exciting video. Of course, I'm back dyeing my hair, but I'm not really dyeing it. I'm just bringing it back to its natural, not natural, its regular blonde color. So obviously, if you have not subscribed to me for very long, you may not know that I dyed my hair a lot a month ago, almost two months ago. I dyed my hair pink and purple, and then I got engaged two days later. So that was really fun, but I am going to my best friend's wedding this upcoming week. I needed to get my pink hair out. So as you'll see later on, my hair wasn't super super pink and purple but there was still like some spots where it really like kept hold and like wouldn't go away so i am going to show you guys how to get that unwanted color out of your hair that's maybe lingering onto your hair um i used two different methods um one of them the first one that i used is the shampoo and vitamin c trick and that one is a little less intense it's a little less drying and damaging to your hair. And if you do that method a few times, um, you will see that your color will go get out of your hair faster, but it's not going to be as fast as the second method, which I did, which is the bleach bath. You want something really quick that you don't have to wait a couple washes for. I suggest doing the second one. I honestly, at first, this video was going to be just the vitamin C and shampoo one, but it didn't work as well as I thought it was going to. It did fade my purple, but it didn't get it all out, so then I resorted to the bleach bath. Uh, as you can tell, my hair is its blonde state again, and I am ready to go to Florida and not have purple in my hair. If you want to see how to get any color hair dye out of your hair, just continue watching this video. Okay, so I am back in my grandma's bathroom. I have my daily clarifying shampoo. Has a lot of bad ingredients in it, but it's fine, it's fine. It's gonna strip all of the color. And then I have the vitamin C tablets here. So this is what they look like. So so this is a meat tenderizer and I'm gonna go ahead and crush these all up. I'm gonna go ahead and take this outside real quick. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it out now. About 30 minutes. Looks like, I don't know if you can tell at all. <laughs> Room 2110, I knocked on the door at the penthouse suite, cause I- I'm gonna go ahead and throw in a conditioner real quick. Explanation. Red solo cups all over the floor and your friends passed out, sleeping in that bed. To hang out in. I guess you threw yours. Put my hair on my little towel. So, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and eat lunch. Let this dry. I'm going to put my leave-in conditioner in. Yeah, I'll come back in a few minutes. Well, it's gonna be a second for you, but it's gonna be a few minutes for me. Okay. Back from lunch. So let's go ahead and take this out. My hair should be a lot more dry now. So I still see a little bit of purple in my hair. What the heck? What the heck? <sighs> That's so annoying. Okay, well, I'm gonna put my Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Restore Leave-In Conditioner in my hair. I feel like to take a, a good size mount. And just put that all in my hair. Make sure it's nice and in there. Well, it's a lot 
less noticeable. I can say that for sure. Okay, this is day one's attempt of trying to get the purple out of my hair. Um, well, it didn't really work. That's really upsetting because I really thought it was gonna work. But that's okay. So tomorrow is my day off, but I really need to get this out of my hair by Monday because I'm going to Florida on Monday. So I really, 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 really need this to be out of my hair. I am going to wait until tomorrow, so I'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay, I am back. It is the next day. So let me take my hair down. Here is what my hair looks like. So it is actually a lot less pink, but there's still like, as you can tell, in this section here in the back, I believe it is pink. So I'm going to do a very light bleach bath. So if you don't know what a bleach bath is, it's basically just something to strip your color. It's not supposed to completely bleach. It's just supposed to lighten your hair and take out any unwanted color. This is all the things that I need. You put one part shampoo, two parts conditioner, eight parts bleach. So of course I got <laughs> the one, the only Knight and Wilson Color Freedom Cream Bleach. If you don't know why I'm laughing, it's because I used this in the video that I did my roots. I will link that video down below. I'm definitely not using all of this, for sure not, but also it might give me a little cute lift. Yeah, I'm going to start mixing this up. I'm also going to try not to touch my roots because your girl's roots are trying to be grown out. I found this on YouTube, this girl who did this bleach bath. So one part equals, I'm using a tablespoon. A few moments later. I might redo this because that's gonna be way too much. Eight tablespoons is way too much. I'm gonna redo this. So I got a teaspoon. I think a teaspoon is gonna be way better because I'm just gonna make way too much. So one teaspoon of conditioner, two teaspoons of shampoo, three teaspoons of water, And then eight teaspoons of the cream. I honestly might do less than that. I might just do four, honestly, just cause I don't want it super concentrated. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just do four. And then this is the peroxide. So then four uh, teaspoons of this. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and mix this all around. So I have mixed this up as good as I can. And I'm just gonna go ahead and start. Jade, this is for you. This is for you and your wedding. So I'm just going to start from bottom to top. For party and you chose not to invite me. Yeah, you threw yourself a party, but you wanted me for a good time. You said text me, but you get From 2110, what I come here for I wanted to talk, but you kept slurring your words Well, it's not your best presentation I know you threw yourself a party And you chose not to invite me Yeah, you threw yourself a party But you wanted me for a good time when you said Text me when you can
Okay, so here's my hair all done. And I'm gonna leave it in for like 15 minutes, 15, 20 minutes, my battery's about to die. So I'm gonna go change it and I'll be back when I'm rinsing it. I totally forgot to put in a new battery, but. So I think it's lifted pretty well. Wait, is it not? Wait, hold on. So the lighting to me makes it look like it still has purple in it, but when I look in the mirror, it doesn't. Obviously, I'm not perfect, so I missed some spots. So like I went through and like looked around and you know, there's some spots when I lift up that are still pink. Like, I don't know if you will be able to tell, but there's like some spots up here that are still pink. I didn't get them super well, but that's okay. I think the majority of it is pretty much out. Hopefully, I'm crossing my fingers. I'm hoping that I put enough bleach in that it's lifted so i'm hoping for the best so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go ahead and rinse it out and put the shampoo in the clarifying shampoo because this literally cleanses everything it strips your hair and then i'm gonna go in with the bold unique purple shampoo i'm not gonna keep it in for super long i'm literally just gonna put it in my hair maybe let it sit for like a second and then rinse it out and then i'm going to towel dry my hair i'm gonna put in my shea moisture it's open it kind of looks like throw up it's kind of gross but yeah so i'm gonna put this in here i'm gonna leave it in for about like 15 minutes i'm gonna go clean my makeup brushes so i'm gonna go do that right now So my hair literally feels like a horse's mane. It is super, super rough. So it's definitely gonna need this treatment. So, oh my gosh, it feels so rough. Like, look, that is literally what my hair looks like. I'm gonna put a whole big thing in my hair. My roots, I'm just gonna work it in my roots. Those on the floor only wanted me Just put it up in a bun. I'm just gonna let that sit in my hair for about 20 minutes and then I'll come back and we'll brush it out and we'll blow dry it and we'll see what it looks like. All right, it's been over 20 minutes and I'm gonna go ahead and take this mask out. Hopefully my hair is revived a little bit. Over the floor and your friends passed out sleeping in that bed. You wanted us to hang out in. I guess you threw your Alrighty, so I'm going to go ahead and let this dry. I'm not going to blow dry it because obviously I just put bleach in my hair and um, I'm going to be styling it and putting heat on it when I'm in Florida for Jade's wedding. So I'm just gonna let it air dry and I'm gonna put in my Shea Moisture Leave-In Conditioner. And then I'm going to go ahead and let that air dry. Once my hair is completely dry, I will go ahead and show you the final results. I think it will be good. I think it will be good. Okay, I'm back. And so this is what my hair looks like dried. There's no pink in it whatsoever. Um, honestly, it's a lot lighter. Like the places that I did put the bleach, it's a lot lighter. I'm really glad I did not put more bleach in it because it would have just lifted way too much. Even that just small amount of bleach lifted my hair. And I'm really, really happy with the results. I mean, obviously it just looks natural now. I don't see any sort of pink in my hair or color or anything and I'm glad I did that like purple shampoo and I'll probably put that purple shampoo in my hair for like two minutes um, before I leave just to give it a little bit more of a white silvery look instead of like this yellow because I haven't gotten my hair done in a while so that's why it's kind of looking a little like on the yellower side but yeah oh, oh. All 
right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I know it was a little, like, I didn't know what I was doing. Um, I thought the vitamin C was going to work, but obviously it didn't get it all out. So I went to the bleach bath. But now you have two ways to get your hair back to its original state. So yes, um, thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already. Also leave me any comments of any video suggestions you want me to do in the comments down below. I would love to hear from you guys. And of course, go ahead and follow me on my Instagram, which is lily underscore bear with three R's. I am always on there doing daily stuff on there. So you can go ahead and follow me and check me out on my Instagram. And yeah, with that being said, I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.